Hello Sagittarius, welcome to Great Little Tarot and this reading is from 22nd of October, 28th of October. So let's check what are the messages for you. Messages for Sagittarius. Harvest. Nine of Wands, Three of Wands, Four of Chalices. Knight of Wands. So here we have Three of Wands with the Three of Wands. This is about something that is uh, starting at this point in your life. Because with this Nine of Wands, Sagittarius, this could be someone who was, uh, you know, trying to hide their feelings. This person was feeling that. Uh, they shouldn't be expressing much um, this is how they are brought up and uh, they feel that uh, one should not express too much to anyone and in fact this person is feeling that expressing their desires will overwhelm you or you may think that uh, they are too much to handle this person have some jealousy as well I mean here with this knight of wands they look at you, they feel that you are this perfection. You know what to do and how to do. This person loves the way you carry yourself. And uh, they feel like you attract a lot of people. They feel that, uh, you know, you, you can um, handle your life by yourself. You don't need anyone. And it's like they already know that... Um, you will be in a relationship if you want to, not because you need to. And uh, that is kind of, uh, you know, scary for this person. This person knows that you are going your way and uh, they have some issues. I mean, this person knows that a lot of people are attracted to you. They love the way you interact with others. They do love your social circle. But there is this insecurity, there is this fear of losing you and uh, that is why this person is not feeling comfortable. This person also feels like if they express themselves, they will be taken for granted. And uh, maybe this is something they have been taught by others, like uh, they shouldn't chase anyone, they shouldn't express themselves much or else uh, you know, nobody, nobody is going to value them and uh, that is why this person is trying hard to keep their feelings to themselves. It's not like they will run away or they will not speak up, but certainly Sagittarius, this person is not going to say what you are expecting from them. This person is feeling that they need to have certain boundaries and uh, they shouldn't cross those boundaries when it comes to expressing them themselves also here we have this harvest with this harvest this person feels that uh, you are this reward you are this uh, blessing from the universe you are something that fulfills them this person finally feels that they are in the right place they are with the right person and uh, they are more than thankful to have you in their life they just uh, you know, say thanks to the universe again and again because uh, you were there because uh, before meeting you this person had left the hope that they will find someone like you but at the same time this person is feeling that uh, they need to be cautious with this four of chalices certainly this person is going to give you a lot with the three of cups they will say the nice things, they will do a lot of things you expect them to do, but something very important 
will not be done or will not be said and it will make you upset. You will keep wondering what this person is up to, what they are feeling like. And you might be frustrated at why this person is not coming to the point. You may have this expectation whenever you meet this person that this time this person is going to offer you friendship, they are going to offer you love or they are going to take this relationship to the next level. But every time they come back, they are on the same point. And that could be quite frustrating for you, Sagittarius. With the three of wands, this person knows that uh, they are supposed to go on this journey. They are tempted to take this journey. But, uh, you know, something inside them is stopping them. This person feels that um, it's better if you can come to save them. Or if you can come to... Um, take them uh, where they belong. This person feels like, uh, what if you open up first? What if you express your feelings first? They are feeling that, uh, you know, it will make them safe. And uh, that is why this person is not uh, taking this risk. They are not strong enough to take this risk. And, um, you know, that could be quite annoying. However, this is a general reading. This may not resonate with everyone. The energy could be reversed as well. Also, you can check your moon and rising sign. Let's go ahead and check some more messages for you. Six of chalices. The moon. Six of Wands. So here we have the Six of Chalices. For many of you, you might have already spent a lot of time in this relationship. You may be dealing with someone who is a friend or probably a childhood friend and uh, you do have been through a lot but still this person is not uh, taking the necessary step this is something uh, that you should be worried about I mean with the moon beneath the surface there is something that you may not like and it could be as simple as they not being enough courageous, they not being enough decisive, they not being enough uh, strong to uh, take this change and uh, to have the strength to take the risk. Also, we have this two of agents. This person has left you on the crossroads and they are on the crossroads themselves. They don't know what to do next with the set universe is trying to tell you something listen to that listen to your intuition listen to the things around you maybe you are going to spot a lot of synchronicities or you are going to come across some coincidences that will make you uh, surprised and uh, you will keep thinking what is this about so clearly you are getting some messages maybe you're, you will get some codes or some people may repeat the same thing to you and uh, you'll feel like the universe is trying to tell you something. With the Six of Wands, the tarot is telling you, follow your heart and you will be victorious. With this Nine of Wands, you know where you're going and what you need to do. So speak up your mind and uh, let your feelings be known. If you are feeling this four of chalices, you are not satisfied, let this person know that uh, um, they are not doing enough and uh, you are not happy. So it's about expressing yourself and by expressing yourself, you're not gonna lose anything, Sagittarius. Let's check an oracle message for you. Horus, 
cosmic gateway. Your thoughts are magnetic and powerful, miraculous changes are occurring. So here your thoughts are really magnetic, you are attracting what you are thinking. So a lot of changes are coming across you and uh, you know, you won't believe whatever is going to happen. So it looks like something surprising is waiting for you. And the surprise will make everything clear and you will know where you want to go. So this was the reading for this week. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Till next video. Bye.